Hello everyone. My name is Ina Kalia Paski. I'm the principal of St. Pascal Regional Catholic School. And today I would like to tell you about that at St. Pascal Regional, we believe, learn, love, and connect. This is series three out of four that we talk about our pillars. So far we have discussed about we believe and we learn at our school. Those recordings you can find in our YouTube channel. So please welcome to check it out. And today we're gonna focus on um, we love. So at St. Pascal Regional, we are family and we are the future. When you come into our building, you will see our belief pillars posted at door number one and door number five. So students every day walk by them and are reminded about what we believe in and what our um, expectations are at school. So make sure that you check our link right here, how we introduce these beliefs to our students and how excited they were about it. So I will start about we love. So we believe in, in whole child development. We believe that each child is a unique and precious gift from God who is worthy of our love and respect and is highly capable of academic growth. We also believe in educating the whole child by focusing on the spiritual, emotional, intellectual, social, and physical strength and needs of every student. Finally, we believe that each child can experience the true joy in learning, and this can lay the path for success in high school and beyond. The way how we execute this is through our responsive classroom approach, City Connects program, and peace of mind counseling. Responsive classroom is a student-centered social emotional learning approach that teaches students about discipline and how to treat each other. When students come to our school, we start our day with the morning circle where students learn how to greet each other, maintain eye contact, and call each other by name. After that, they have the question of the day that would be like an icebreaker where they can learn a little bit about each other, get comfortable with each other. And then they will finish with some social game where they will play with a classmate and a homeroom teacher. After that, they will do a prayer, talk about a schedule, and do a pledge of allegiance. The day usually ends with the end circle, closing circle. And during that uh, closing circle, students talk about unfinished business, how they feel at the end of the day. So if somebody has any concerns, a homeroom teacher can follow up with that student to make sure that we resolve any issues that we have. And throughout the whole day, teachers provide some brain breaks for students so students keep staying engaged in the classrooms and are ready to learn. City Connect is our optimized student support program where we focus on social, emotional, academic, family, and health strength and needs of ever students. At the beginning of the year, in September and October, we get together with a homeroom teacher, a teacher who taught a student before, a counselor, our City Connects coordinator, and the principal, and talk about each student in whole details. And after that, we create individual learning plan where we highlight academic goal for the student in reading and math, and also social emotional goal if the student needs it. And this is a document that we keep evolving throughout the year. So it starts with that individual student review, then we tier the student to see what level of support that student needs, if it's intense support or um, medium support, or uh, little to no support in social emotional uh, domain. And then we involve families into that process to make sure that they are aware of what's going on. And then we find different community partners, how we can support that student. For example, maybe the student needs individual counseling or maybe group counseling, for example, in friendship issues or to learn how to deal with anxiety. Or maybe a student needs a mentor or a tutor to help them uh, being caught up. Or maybe a student needs an IEP plan. So, after we create that tailored support plan for every student, we do reach out for the feedback from teachers and parents and then do a follow-up. So that's the system that we use the whole year. Finally, we are very lucky to be one of 10 schools 
uh, to get peace of mind counseling that was provided by Cisco um, to have uh, Dr. Jules Nolan uh, from um, Phoenix School Counseling uh, to work with our school on uh, training the whole staff in nurtured heart approach. So during this nurtured heart approach, our teachers get uh, training about how to deal with different behaviors in the school. For example, there are three components of it that we are learning at our school as the staff. Absolutely no. I refuse to energize the negativity. Absolutely yes. I will relentlessly energize the positive. And absolutely clear, I will provide clarity around rules and provide unenergized consequences when a rule is broken. We also got an extra date of counseling on site. So we have this uh, peace of mind counselor on Tuesdays and we have a city connects coordinator on Thursdays and Friday. We also are lucky to have uh, uh, different uh, Zoom counseling presentations that are available for parents that they can do uh, watch in real life or as a recording for a certain time. And we are advertising those in our newsletters. So please make sure that you take advantage of it. We are very excited that our staff is professionally trained on different topics related to social emotional um, topics, you know, for, for students and parents. And also we are gonna get a middle school retreat later this year for students uh, to make sure that we keep working on helping everyone in our school. So um, this is what we have for We Love Pillar. And next week we will be talking about We Connect. Thank you.